Hello everybody, uh, how are you doing? This is Sam here with uh, yet another video on Bass NB 8.5.5. As you can see, we will be going over a profile creation and um, the profiles which we will be creating are uh, DMGR, application server, custom profile, job manager profile and admin agent profile. So there are two ways uh, you can create the profiles. The first one will be UI which is pretty simple. I will be creating a video on that later and the main focus will be on CLI uh, everybody asks for a command these days and uh, it, it's better if you, you know, uh, can produce the commands so the commands to be used are uh, like this you are asked to be there in your binary directory for the VAS installation once you are there you have to run this uh, script called as manage profiles with the arguments of create profile name followed with the profile name uh, whatever you like then you have to have the template part let me talk about the template part here so there will be a folder called as profile templates under your uh, app server file system directory so uh, it's it's it comes with the bass and the installation once you have uh, bass and the installed in your machine you can probably export a folder or file structure called as file directory called as you know profile templates so it, it's what is this profile uh, template or a uh, yeah, template path so it's like this um, that's a blueprint which will be used uh, when you want to create any profile on VASND so for each and every profile they have I mean IBM has a uh, profile blueprint using which uh, we can simplify the creation so for DMGR um, you have a, a, a file directory called as uh, lowercase dmgr i mean um, dmgr yeah so under app server you have profile templates under which you have dmgr you have to use that template path for uh, creation of dmgr profile so that's that then for cell name you have to give a cell name then node name which will be followed with the host name so that's that for application server creation it's pretty much simple but uh, you know the template path will differ uh, I, I was telling you that under app server you have folder called as uh, uh, profile uh, templates so for dmgr creation you have to go and use dmgr folder for uh, application server profile you have to use default just keep in mind we will see the real time example for that so for application server profile the template path will lead you to a folder called as default for custom profile creation the only difference will be with you know uh, with the template path instead of um, dmgr or uh, instead of you know uh, default you have to provide uh, managed for custom profile creation just remember the blueprint of your uh, uh, you know profile or a template path will lead you to a folder or file, uh, file directory called as managed so that's that then you have two more profiles just like a job manager and admin agent for a job manager and a admin agent the templates are I mean the template folders are similar there is only one uh, which will be leading you to management so under app server you will have profile templates directory under which you have management so, so you have to stick with that for a job manager and admin agent creation and for only for these two job manager and admin agent you have to have an additional argument called as server type so for um, job manager the server type will be job manager uh, and whereas uh, for uh, admin agent that will be admin agent so <coughs> this is the commands which will be using these are the commands which we are going to use so that's that we will get started with a you know virtual machine uh, so this is my uh, red hat linux uh, 6.4 uh, bm so just make sure that you are in the bin directory i am here in the bin directory then you, you have to run the script called as manage profiles dot sh the first argument uh, you have to use is I'm just missing something so remember just to run now in the script you have to follow this then the first time you will be create and then follow with the profile name I'll say dmgr01 and 
you have to provide your uh, profile template if you remember so that's this template path my template path will be something similar to this slash opt slash ibm slash web sphere slash app server and i have a uh, folder called as profile templates under which i have dmgr for uh, dmgr this is the template path i have to you know use so then the next argument will be the cell name uh, i will say dmgr 01 cell and the next thing you uh, have to use is the node name I'll say dmgr01 underscore bash if I'm node 1 and uh, the final thing you have to have your own host name here my host name is bash if I'm node 1 so that that's pretty much uh, uh, all the things are required uh, uh you need to while you know you have to create a dmgr profile so we'll just run this and see if it throws any error we can we can you know see that so uh, as you can see um, it uh, created uh, um, a dmgr profile you can you can see that so the next thing will be you know creation of uh, an application server profile so this will be a you know command we have to use manage profile dot asset create profile name i'm uh, sticking with app server uh, 01 the template as i told you under app server profile template you have to have a uh, you know uh, directory called as default so whenever you want to create an application server profile make sure that you are you know sticking with default as a uh, template path so then you have to have your node name i'll say something like this it's fine for now so then you have to have your host name as also cell name it's not uh, mandatory once you federate uh, any application server profile with the dmgr it will take the cell name from your dmgr so that's the reason why i am not uh, using that cell name here let's let's run this and you know wait for the result So that uh, got created, the app server 01 exists now, uh, which is a kind of you know application server. It's a kind of you know application server. So we have done with DMGR creation as well as you know application server creation. We will now think about uh, creating a custom profile. So this is the command which we will be using. Create profile name will be custom 01. Template path will uh, lead you here. Uh, managed okay let, let's uh, see what's wrong with that so give me a minute I'll, I'll just debug so I was missing this cell name or node name and host name let me see what happens now so just remember so uh, for, for DMGR it's always DMGR uh, um, profile template uh, path you have to give and for application server it should be default and for uh, your custom profile it should be managed so that uh, got created uh, we have uh, you know we are done with our you know, custom profile creation as well now the next thing will be an admin agent creation and uh, job manager creation so this will be the command used for creating uh, admin agent profile manage profile create profile name then i'm giving you double know, then the template path uh, as i told you for admin agent and uh, job manager this will be the same you have to go towards a uh, management uh, file system then the server type there is an additional uh, argument command line argument for uh, job manager as well as your admin agent that will be server type for admin agent it will be you know admin underscore agent and for job manager it will be job underscore manager so that's that we will run this so 
our admin agent uh, got created now we will uh, you know create uh, this job manager now yeah so for uh, creation of job manager this will be the command which will be using uh, i'll stick with the name of uh, jm and uh, the template path as i told you uh, you have to lead it towards a management folder and uh, uh, the special uh, argument called as error type that will be job underscore manager just run this so as you can see uh, the job manager profile is created so this is how you create uh, profiles uh, in uh, last in the um, 8.5.5 that's it um, thanks for watching the video guys um, and now uh, give me a thumbs up uh, like my video do subscribe to my channel and uh, um, you are uh, you know most welcome to give some suggestion thanks a lot i'll see you in the next one bye